Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You have several options available to you when you want to save your elements image files. There are many different formats that you can save the file to depending on your need. If you click the file command within the menu bar, note that after making changes to an image you can simply click the save command to save any changes to the image in the same place with the same name using the same file format. Alternately, you can use the Save As command that is also located under the File command to save a copy of the image with either a different format, a new name, or a new location, or all three. Note that if you check the Include an Elements Organizer checkbox when you are saving the image, the image will be stored within the Elements Organizer as well. So to save a file and change its format, you can simply choose File and Save As from the menu bar. In the Save As dialog box, you select where to save the file by making a choice from the Save In dropdown. Then ensure that you have the name that you want to give to the file typed into the File Name text box. If you want to change the file format, then just make a new selection from the Format drop-down. Also note that you have additional saving options at the bottom of this dialog box, such as if you want to save the color profile along with the image. You can check any of these checkboxes that appear at the bottom of the Save As dialog box. Note that some of them may not be available depending on the format that you have selected. Now once you've set all of your options, selected the location to save it into, and given it a file name, simply click the Save button to save the file with the settings that you specified. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.